Protests have erupted worldwide over President Donald Trump's decision to recognize Jerusalem as the capital of Israel. Tonight, hundreds of demonstrators shut down major intersections in the loop in protest. CBS 2. This is not acceptable! This is not acceptable! Jerusalem's our capital! Jerusalem's our capital! The signs, the flags, even the chants. Palestine will never die! A unified echo of protesters at Federal Plaza who don't agree with President Trump's decision recognizing Jerusalem as the capital of Israel, moving the embassy from Tel Aviv. Jerusalem is not yours to give. Jerusalem is for Palestine. Neither Trump nor Israel have the right to make unilateral decisions about Jerusalem. And this group that started at Federal Plaza making it very clear that they see Jerusalem as the capital of Palestine, now taking that message to the Israeli consulate. Palestinian people are not happy about this a capital change, and Jerusalem has always been a capital of Palestine, and we will not accept anything other than that. And Thursday, protests turned violent across the West Bank and Gaza Strip, Jerusalem, a sacred site for both Israelis and Palestinians. It's not something for peace. We are trying to come with peace with Israel, but this is definitely not a step for that. Israel's Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu again expressed joy today over the President Trump's announcement. Yesterday's uh, statement by uh, President Trump, I think, is such a milestone. Netanyahu told the Foreign Ministry Council in Jerusalem he's been in touch with more countries. He says they'll issue similar statements of recognition, but did not name any. The U.S. plans to open an embassy there, a move it's